everyone! Welcome to Digital Bruce Beginnings, a program for children three to five years old and their caregiver. My name is Megan Brown and I'm an educator here at the Bruce Museum. Today's program, we're going to be exploring all about tools. We'll explore an exhibition, we'll read a book, and we'll do some imaginative play. Hope you enjoy! Before we get started, I'm going to give you a quick view of our exhibition, House on the Hill, The Changing Face of the Bruce Museum. I encourage you and your adult to pause throughout the video to get better views of the pieces in the exhibition, House on the Hill, The Changing Face of the Bruce Museum. Through this, you'll see different explorations of how the Bruce Museum has transformed over the past century and a half. There are numerous historical images which will show the evolution of the structure from its conversion from a mansion to a modern museum highlighting the intersections of art and science. up close at this photo. What is happening in the picture? Does it look like a construction site? Do you see any tools or people using tools? Take a close look at the photograph and talk with your adult about some of the tools you might use to build a new building or change a museum. What tools would you use to build? What would you change to a museum if you could rebuild it? Pause this video, explore the photograph, talk about tools with your adult, and I'll see you back here in just a minute. What tools did you discuss with your adult? Did you learn any new tools? How about we read a book about tools and maybe we'll see if you learn some more. As we discussed earlier, it takes a lot of different tools to help build a museum or change it and expand it, just like the Bruce. So I thought it would be really neat to read a book all about tools that you may not be familiar with. Today we'll be reading Toolbook by Gail Gibbons. Tools help us build. There are tools that help us measure, like rulers, tape measures, and even a level. 
or any of these new tools for you. There are tools that cut that include axe, shears, and saws. Shears kind of look like scissors. Tools that scrape and shape like a plane, a gouge, a chisel, and a file. What are these tools working on? Looks like wood to me. Tools that pound, a hammer, a sledgehammer, and a mallet. Have you ever used a hammer before? Tools that grip, a wrench, a vise, pliers, and an open-ended wrench. Are there any new tools that you've learned now? Tools that make holes, and that's my favorite, a shovel, bits, drills, and more bits, and even more bits down here. There are so many different tools to make holes. Who knew? Tools that turn, screwdrivers, screws, nails, nuts, and bolts that hold things together. So there's a screw, a nail, a bolt, and a nut, and this is what they look like in the wood. Tools go in a toolbox. The end. Did you guys learn about any new tools that you didn't discuss earlier with your adult? Pause this video, talk about some of those tools, come back and I'll see you in just a minute. Now that we visited a museum's exhibition, learned all about different tools, how about we get up and stretch our minds and our imagination? The first activity you can do with your adult that I like to do at home is called I Spy. So when you're playing I Spy, you'll say, I spy with my little eye, and you'll suggest something like a tool, maybe a hammer. And one thing I suggest if you're playing I Spy is getting a tube made out of cardboard to help look around and try out some of those new tools you just learned about. Another activity you can do at home is trying to sort tools. So as we saw in the book, there are so many different types of tools, but they do similar things, like put holes in things, help shape wood, or help cut objects. Try sorting those different tools like you saw in the book and see if you can add any new ones with your adult. Thank you for participating in Digital Bruce Beginnings. For more online content, please visit www.brucemuseum.org. And if you create something or want to share a video today of you having fun doing these imaginative play activities, with the permission of your adult, share that content with the hashtag Bruce Museum on social media. Bye friends!